If you've ever set up a Gmail account on your iOS device, you realize that the default behavior of the delete button is actually changed to archive. While this works great for some users, others would prefer to have the default behavior of delete back. This is Jason Cipriani, a CNET how-to contributor, and today I'm going to show you how to change the archive button back to delete, or for other accounts on your iOS device, change the delete button to archive. Alright, so to change the archive button back to a delete button for your Gmail account, what you'll need to do is go into settings, tap on your Gmail account, and while you're viewing your account info, you'll see an archive messages toggle switch. Go ahead and turn that off. What that does is it takes the archive button away and puts back the delete button so each time you press that now your message will actually be deleted on the server. Similarly we can do this with an iCloud account but in reverse. Go into your iCloud account settings, tap down on mail, and you'll see an archive messages switch that is default to off. If you turn that back on it'll actually archive your messages in your iCloud account similarly to as it would with Gmail. Leaving it off would delete the messages off the server. Once again, this is Jason Cipriani. Thank you for watching the video today. Make sure to join us over at howto.cnet.com for more great tech tips.